story is that BART police are saying they have stepped up safety measures across stations, and that has made a big difference for riders. Officials releasing some new data showing the effectiveness of its safe and clean plan. And just a sample of its success here is they're saying felony arrests are up 62% from last year. Ground for us, Teresa Stasio in the East Bay. After talking with some riders, she joins us live with their reaction. Oh, hi, Justine. We're here at the Arinda BART station. Now, the BART police chief, Kevin Franklin, applauding the data, saying that this is a reflection of the hard work that the officers have been doing to try and make the overall system safer. Take a look at some of the images that the BART police department has sent out. This shows just an example of some of the guns that they have recently confiscated. You can see for yourself all of these illegal handguns. They took in 49 illegal handguns. Handguns in 2023. That's up from 40 in 2022. That's the most guns BART police have ever recovered in a year. BART officers made 726 felony arrests in 2023. Compare that with 448 in 2022. BART police chief Kevin Franklin saying in a quote, since we started deploying more patrol officers to ride trains, we have seen an impact and our riders are telling us that they noticed a difference. We spoke with some riders and they shared their thoughts. Take the BART uh, Monday to Friday in the morning and I come back at this time in the early afternoon and um, I've noticed there's more uh, staff for the safety and I really appreciate that. Also knows the trains are cleaner and um, I have I have not had any problem on BART myself. Now, BART says a quarterly performance review shows riders who reported seeing BAR police on their trip reached a record high of 20%. Again, the chief saying that the increased safety is mostly due to getting more officers into the department and that they continue to have a robust recruitment. Reporting live here in Arinda, I'm Teresa Stasio. Back to you, Justine.